All right, so this video is addressed to dark calls on one of the ARC subreddits, and it's regarding a problem he posted where he can't go into his house because the roof piece stops him from doing so without crouching. And yeah, that's annoying. That's ARC for you. <clears throat> the devs did not really make a great building system. But I have two demo houses here. They're not exact replicas of the house shown in the video, but they're close enough to show two potential solutions to this problem, neither of which are ideal, and I'm by far not a master builder in ARC, but they might be acceptable. Uh, so let's go ahead and look at probably what I would say is the less involved solution first, the, the easier one. So you'd want to get the build state of the entryway to something like this right here. Place the foundation. You're going to be picking that foundation up pretty quick. You're just putting that foundation there so that you can snap this one here. Then you're going to want to put yeah, color right there. And then you go in here and hopefully before the timer goes out on you, you pick up this one. And you replace it. And that should give you a lower snap point. Yeah, there it is. Did it snap? Yeah, it did. Okay, so now we can hopefully pick up this. And okay, we did not make it in time to pick up that one, which is unfortunate. You're more on your game. You can do this a lot quicker than I did, right? Then what you can do is... You can place a doorway. Where do I have that? There it is. Right there like that. That'll let you go inside. Okay. Now the problem there is that you have the misalignment. So aesthetically it's it's not as nice. But it'll it'll let you actually walk in without crouching. Now you can do this a slightly different way and go ahead and I'll place this again like that and uh, before I place this second one to snap it I'll make the door frame the very next piece then I'll go ahead and snap that next foundation I'll get the pillar out I'll go into here Hopefully pick that up before yeah timer runs out. If you're if you're on like an official, that's that's kind of a problem. Yeah. Um then we'll go ahead and find that lower snap point we've made ourselves. It can be difficult to find it. You just gotta kinda fiddle with it. Oh, I had it. <laughs> Come on. There we go. Okay, now when we get rid of this, now our inside is nice and lined up and we can walk in and out of it without having to crouch, but problem with this is you get this little gap at the bottom. Now I tried a bit messing around like fence foundations and stuff. I know that the Adobe fence foundation is kind of weird. It sticks up like that. It's not flush to the ground like the other fence foundations. And getting it to snap to that door and not some other weird spot is really hard with the door frame and the rough there. So you can either do it the one way and live with misalignment inside of it, or you can do it this way 
and live with the gap. Now, there is one thing didn't try. Let's give that a try now, because maybe we can make this look look uh, look a lot better. There we go. Where is is it called a rug? Yeah. Let's see. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, that might actually work. Okay, that doesn't look terrible from the outside. Feels like I can't walk up with that there. Uh, let's try to place some stairs. Oh, hmm. Okay. Rugs all the way down here. Can we place another one? Right there? Yeah, look at that. That's, uh, not too bad. And that's basically the first solution. The second one is a little more involved. It involves more pieces, though less wasted, potentially wasted pieces. If you're playing on a server where you don't have this little uh, gun that lets you and uh, delete things and where you can't just call up items in creative mode. So the first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to frame this out with double door frames. And yeah, you do have to put this third one between here. Otherwise, you can't place a piece you need up there. And then the next thing you're going to want to do is pull out some walls. And I believe... Yeah, uh... These do have to be gone in order to do this. I'll so we'll open that up a bit more. Pull out our wall pieces. Got that one. Finding your snap points can be a real pain. You can use the Q key to jump them around, but that doesn't always help. Oh, I had it. Yeah. Ooh. There we go. Hmm. I don't like that piece. facing that way. I want to make that piece facing this way. Yeah, there we go. That looks okay. Now we'll go ahead and we'll get some of these sloped wall pieces. Oop, that's wrong. Try that again. Here, let's put that one on that side. And we'll use the other sloped wall piece for that side. Like I said, this middle one's necessary because that supports that wall, which in turn supports the next wall piece that we're going to put up there. So it's a little bright out. There we go. And go ahead and we'll place this piece next and then a wall piece here now if I've done this correctly yeah we can walk in um, these are these are solid here you can walk kind of against the wall you get a little bit of a jam right here this actually looks nice this this doesn't look bad and then all we have to do, finish up, is place our pieces here. Oh, is that right? It doesn't look right. There. Go in here and do it. There we go. 
Um, this one I like a little better. Aesthetically overall, it looks better. And you also get this kind of space up in here. I imagine you probably do something like uh, a hatch frame. Let's see here. Let's throw up. Yeah, small hatch frame. We'll make a ladder as well. Like that. Where'd our ladder go? Hmm. Kind of don't like the ladder right there. But you know what? It's functional. And now you have a little crawl space up in here where you could store some stuff. Um, I've noticed you can fit like about four preserving bins in a space like this where you just walk in and look up and you have access to some storage. So even though you can walk through this ladder if you don't like it aesthetically, there's really no reason why you have to go up in there if you put storage containers in there and you're accessing them through this hole. But yeah, there you go. Two solutions to your problem. I know they're not ideal, but that's that's what I can come up with based on how the building mechanics of this game work. So hope that helps and I hope it helps someone else too somewhere down the line. Have a good one.